everybody i'm back with another video um as you can see my hair is pretty much all the same color from what you can see right now um but one thing i do want to say since if you watched my last two videos you will see me like what process i took to get to this color and being this light um as you can tell well you can't really tell on the screen but my hair is very very dry and like stringy and i'm not even gonna lie i pulled out like a good chunk of my hair so I'm just gonna try to brush it as good as I can. And for this video, um, you probably are tired of, you guys are probably tired of my hair videos. See, this is just like not how it should be. Okay, so in this video, um, I am going to do a honey and a coconut oil hair mask to make my hair shiny and smooth because this is just very dry and i am pulling hair out just little pieces so let's just get straight into the video um so i'm just gonna hop like just jump right in as you can see my roots don't match the rest of it and neither does this because it's a little dark um i just finished doing my hair three different times and i probably shouldn't be adding anything else to it but it's very very dry and i've seen a lot of girls do this for their hair i guess it helps um so we're just gonna jump right in start mixing i'm gonna try to brush this as good as i can um so i'm just gonna go ahead and mix the ingredients actually i'm just gonna go ahead and do a time lapse while i brush my hair and then i'll be back to mix the ingredients with you and uh, apply Okay, um, this isn't very like fully brushed through because of how dry it is and I'm losing so much hair. Yeah, that's how much hair I lost washing it. So that's not good. Um, I'm eventually just gonna cut my hair to my shoulders <laughs> because this is just so unhealthy. And this is actually more than likely going to be my last time doing anything to my hair. This is it. This is just the last result. Like, there's nothing else. Uh, I can't damage my hair anymore. So, I'm going to go ahead and start mixing in the ingredients because I don't want to lose any more hair. They say you're supposed to... I'll mix and talk. So, they say that you're supposed to mix in... Um, equal parts and they also say that you're supposed to do this every like two weeks so yeah so it should be like twice a month so i guess i'm just gonna try to keep up with this every two weeks because they said consistency is key which is the case for everything if you want to do something um consistency is key so I'm just going to fill this up to the top with this because I have a lot of hair. And it's like coming out so slowly. Okay, so that's as much as I can get out. Um, I'm pretty sure whatever's left in the bottle is going to fill this up the rest of the way as you can see it's not filled to the top it's like halfway through 
So I'm just going to go ahead and dump this in. And then um, they say not to like heat this up in the microwave or anything because it takes away a lot of the benefits. So we want to have all those benefits locked in um, to get, receive all of them. So I didn't get all of that out. As you can see, there's still some in there. Um, hopefully it'll come out whenever I pour this in here. So... There's like big chunks in this, and this was actually the rest of the bottle. So, I just use the rest of each. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and dump this in here. You're supposed to make sure that this is as liquidy as possible. Um, mine just been sitting in a room, so it's like, I don't know, it goes through getting frozen and <laughs> unfrozen. So I'm just gonna try to like squeeze the rest of that out and get as much of this as we can because coconut oil actually helps a lot with your hair. It helps keep it shiny and everything. So I'm gonna go ahead with the time lapse and just mix this in and start applying. Okay, so I know I said I was gonna do the time lapse of me mixing this and applying it, but I'm just gonna go ahead and finish mixing it on here and then um, go back to doing a time lapse of me applying it. So this is what I am working with. I have all of these chunks of the coconut oil. So all right, I thought I would mix this on here. I'm just gonna go ahead and go back into doing the uh, time lapse of me mixing this and then applying it to my hair. So I'm just gonna go ahead and section it off now. Um, it's kind of gonna be a little hard because I only have one ponytail and my hair is like really crunchy and hard to get through. But yeah, I have to rip through it. Which is not very good. Ow. And I still managed to only pull the littlest piece. Okay, so this is how I'm gonna have it sectioned off. I'm just gonna, that's like super uneven. And this is actually probably a look, like this is actually kind of cute if the bun was a little, you know, regular and this was a little even. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish mixing this. There's like all these chunks from the coconut oil and I just wanted to mix evenly. I don't want a piece like of the chunk to, like I want it to be equal parts, you know? I don't want it to just like explode on my head and get more benefits of that. <laughs> um, I'm actually not 100% sure what the honey does. I do know that the, uh, all the not olive oil the coconut oil um it helps with growth and it helps to make your hair shiny and a little softer and it just gives so many great things so whenever i was looking at videos um about this hair mask 
uh, the videos were saying to only leave on for 10 to 15 minutes and then to rinse off with cool water and a really like tough shampoo. So the shampoo that I'm going to be using, I believe is Pantene. Um, yeah, it's Pantene Pro V. So I'm going to use that and then I'm going to use this. Ocean's Breeze conditioner. Now I'm not gonna use a lot of conditioner because I used so much earlier um, to try to like give my hair that soft and silky feeling that I want it to have. It's not like I was a, a little over exaggerating, but honestly, I feel like like I almost cried today because once I was finished doing my hair and doing the other videos, I like. If you were here feeling this right now, it's just like rough, like it's still soft kind of, but it's like really rough and it's like super sticky and it's so hard to brush. And if I brush it, a big chunk comes out. Like, just listen to this. It's just like so rough. So I am gonna try to have this brushed out a little bit so it's a little easier to apply to my hair and then I'm gonna leave it on for 12 minutes just to meet in the middle so I'm gonna just go ahead with the time lapse and just continue um to mix this this is what I have all these little white chunks so I just want to like hurry up I'm so impatient so i just want to hurry up and like get all those chunks broken down so i'm just gonna go ahead and start the time lapse finish doing this and then start applying it As you guys saw, I just finished applying the whole concoction of the honey and the coconut oil. So now I'm going to let it sit for 15 exact minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and then I will, I'll be back after I rinse it out. So hopefully it's silkier and shinier. <laughs> Okay, guys, I am back, not in my chair. I'm on my, <sighs> kneeling down, kneeling, kneeling down. Okay, so I completely washed it out with the Pantene shampoo and the Ocean Breeze um, conditioner. It's super stringy, and if I go like this and I pull, hair comes out. So... <laughs> I have really damaged hair. Um, so I'm very scared with my hair. And I feel like it's just terrible. But I guess there's nothing I can do but wait and continue to do this every two weeks. Uh, it doesn't feel too bad. It's like super stringy though. So like that's not good obviously. But for the most part, it's not that bad. I didn't lose too much hair. I mean, I pulled out like two chunks. My hair goes down to originally it went down to here. <laughs> no, that can't be right. I couldn't have lost that much hair. Okay, yeah, so it cut my hair comes down to right here and it came down to right here. So I lost that much hair. So I guess this is just, I'm not doing anything else to my hair. Um, I'm just gonna let it 
be like this hopefully in the morning i know your hair is the most fragile oh look at that that was gross it's like super blonde right there so i guess your hair is like at its most damaging and fragile state when it is wet so I don't really want to mess around with it too much. I'm just going to let it dry. I did wash my hair twice today, which I just was reading stuff. Like, it's not really too good to wash your hair every single day, which I don't. Or so often, like, I washed it, like, two, three times already. I washed it, like, five times within the last day. So from last night to today, I washed my hair about, like, five times, which isn't really good. So... I won't need to wash my hair for a while, but as you can see, it's like the roots aren't are light. They're super light compared to what they were. They were my original color, but as you guys can see, I have like a whole bunch of different blonde spots everywhere. And then there's that still that little tint of uh, pink if I move it like this. So um, I'm not going to do anything else to my hair. Um, probably gonna end up just cutting it to like, it's up to right here. So I'm probably just gonna end up cutting my hair to about like right here. Just get all my split ends out and then just let it grow and not even do anything else to it. So yeah, this is the end. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, Okay, it cut out, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, if you're already not subscribed, make sure you guys subscribe and click the post notification bell so you guys can get an update every single time I post. My posting hasn't been consistent recently because I have a lot going on. I explained in my last video, um, or in this case, it'll be like my last three videos because there will be two more before I post this one so I hope you guys just enjoy and make sure to go like and comment on all of my videos support yeah put a thumbs up that's liking so hope you guys like the video like comment subscribe and put, click the post notification bell and make sure you guys share you can share any video of mine Actually, I'm going to do a little challenge. Well, it's not really a challenge, but um, if you watch my videos or if you watch this video at least, I want you to go through and watch all of my videos and make sure you share your favorite video on your favorite social media app and just let me know down below which one you shared it on and your name so that way I can go and check it out maybe give it a like and comment on that so i thank you guys all for the support and just stay tuned for my next video